Oh what does God. eat kids mean to me? Let's go see. On the bus. Eat kids means a lot to me because it is part of our future. We need to keep pushing it to be better and finding out more about technology and keep it on track and make sure that technology improves throughout the years. And that technology does not get outdated. Here, that was Mia. Let's give her a round of applause. What E-Kids means to me, or Brooke Cranin. Enjoy! That is what E-Kids means to Brooke, me. What E-Kids means to me. Well, at first when I was looking at E-Kids, I thought it just meant about devices and computers and all those things. And then I went to E-Kids and I got to learn more about technology and more Google sites. And... I learned that technology has been used a lot over the years. And technology will help our future, our jobs, everything. And it's just changed so much to the old cell phone and now to the new cell phones. That is what eKids, or technology, means to me. I think eKids is important to teach students how to use technology appropriately and also for their future job or career and also to help them in college. Kids is we get to learn about technology and we do fun projects. One of the one of my favorite projects is Animoto. I love Animoto because it was so cool to see how many cool things you could do with technology, including making videos and styling the videos your own way. That was Mia. Let's give her a round of applause. Here, and I'm going to tell you what my favorite things about eKids were. Okay, the first thing is projects. I really like projects because we did Animoto, we did timelines, we did video, and we did a recipe about ourselves. The, my favorite one was Animoto. Um, another thing I like about eKids is BYOD. Bring your own device. You can bring any device that you have at home, and if you don't, you can bring your school. You can have... A, you can use a school computer and you can use a school iPod. Another thing I really liked about eKids is learning about technology. I didn't really know about like that much technology until I came to eKids. So go to eKids next year. It's the best place ever. Hi, I'm Piper and my favorite part of eKids is all the projects we get to do with technology. My favorite project is probably when we get to do the video because we get to make an animation. It's really fun. Okay, let's give her a round of applause. Yeah! I'm gonna. <laughs> what I like about eKids is that you get to hang out with all your friends. You do lots of awesome projects. eKids is so much fun. I would sign up if I were you. Part of eKids was coming in and getting to do a bunch of projects and go on your device. What was your favorite project, Alexis? My favorite project was the Animoto project. That was very cool. Okay, that's Alexis for you guys. What about eKids are the timeline project and the and how you get to learn about technology. My favorite part about eKids is being able to use technology, and my favorite project was Animoto. Bloopers! Uh, my name is Piper, and my favorite part about eKids is all the projects we get to do. Um, with technology, and I don't know. Brooke, and I am going to show and tell you guys. No, I'm just going to tell you guys. My, wow, oh, this is Brooke <laughs> here. And this is my, it's Brooke. Go on, oh my gosh. Okay, guys, I'm Brooke, and I'm going to tell you what my favorite things about eKids were. Well, my first thing was BYOD, and that is for your own device. You could bring in your iPod your tablet, your iPhone, your iPad, anything, a computer, or if you don't have those devices, you can have one of, well, you can't have it. <laughs> <laughs> Mia's favorite things about eKids. Hi, I'm Mia, and my favorite thing about eKids is learning about technology. Um, Brooke, I cannot do Brooke's favorite thing about eKids. My favorite thing about eKids is BYOD. We get to bring our own devices and I love the product projects. My favorite project was Animoto. And I love that we get to learn more about technology because some things I didn't even know last year. So join the kids. Seriously. <laughs> BYOD means and what projects we did. I'm gonna tell you guys about BYOD and projects. 
First, let's start with the fun part. Well, they're both, but let's start with projects. First, we did, in the beginning of the year, a recipe about me. Me! You could put it on a Docker presentation, and it was just about some character traits about you. Another one was animate, my favorite. It was like a video slideshow about you. You had to have five to ten facts all about you. In photos! And the second one, the third one, was video video, an animation video site. Another one was Wix, where you can make your own website. Another eKids project was, um, ooh, um, screencast and how to guide. I picked Animoto and Kids Vids. Um, one more that I will tell you about. It's what we're doing now. It's about helping students understand eKids. And another one. Our last one is what not to do and what to do with BYD. Now, let's go on with BYOD. What's BYOD? I'll answer that question. BYOD stands for Bring Your Own Device Initiative. That means just to bring your own device from home to school and to sign it in with your teacher if your teacher does that. My eKids teacher does that, so I bring it in to her every morning. Well, not every morning because sometimes I keep it locked in my locker. That's another rule. And one rule is, I just said it, keep it locked in your locker. Sign it in with your teacher in the morning if she does that. Keep it in the right hand corner of your desk. Don't be on any angry birds or texting. Be on the appropriate website that your teacher tells you to go on. Or consequences will come. And and don't take anybody's device, don't drop it, or just don't do any dumb things. Because we're here, here to learn, not to play around. eKids was really fun, and I just want to say, I felt like I wanted to learn about eKids. After this year, I just want to say thank you to my teacher, because now I feel like I can teach eKids. And teach how to use technology, which sites that I feel that are better, and which devices work better. That was... BYOD Projects. I hope all of you guys join eKids. It was awesome. I hope you guys all pick eKids in 6th grade, 7th, and 8th. It is so fun.